Good afternoon. The attorney general says he needs more money to help catch and convict people who prey on children online. And he wants sex offenders to pay for that extra help. News 13's Cole Miller is live at the Roundhouse with a look at a new law in the works. Cole? Well, good afternoon, Kim. In short, this bill aims to collect a $140 fee from convicted sex offenders every time they have to register. For the attorney general, the money will help fight what he calls some of the most dangerous criminals. Today, Hector Balderas announced his support for that bill. The bill was introduced by Democratic Senator Jacob Candelario. Now, according to Balderas, the Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force needs money and needs money now. For instance, he says they have just five full-time investigators tracking some 8,000 leads on people trading child pornography here in New Mexico. The bill would require convicted sex offenders pay that $140 fee when they register. Now, the state has 4,000 registered sex offenders, so that would bring in more than half a million dollars. Uh, protecting children at this point is at a crisis level, so I'm hoping the legislature will look at uh, all options they have to maximize funding. We are severely underfunded. And the Internet, task, Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force, excuse me, also goes after predators who try to meet these kids in person. For Balderas, this legislative go around fighting extra funding is his top priority. Back to you. Okay, thank you, Cole. Now, last year alone, the Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force followed up on 490 investigations that led to 98 arrests.